Hello, Beth Page. This is Mr. Kenny, Director of Guidance. We just wanted to reach out to you and wish you and your family well during these unsettling times. We hope that you all remain safe and healthy. We'd like to send you a message that we miss you and we're looking forward to seeing you soon in the Beth Page schools. We're all getting used to our new way of communicating and following up on our education during this period of distance learning. My family is going through the same growing pains that we all are, but we want you to know that the counseling staff is here to help you any capacity possible. We want to make sure that we all remain healthy mentally and physically, so stay active, keep up on your work, reach out with any questions and concerns to any member of our staff at any time. We are Beth Page. Oh, hello, Golden Eagles. It's Mr. Benjamin. Hope everybody's home healthy and safe. Um, we've been out of school for a couple of weeks now. We're going to be out of school a couple more, it looks like. Um, but while you're home, hopefully, hopefully you're using your time constructively. Um, after we're done with all our work, uh, we've been trying to do things to better ourselves. I've been learning how to play the guitar. I've been running. I'm trying to grow, grow my hair out. Um, spend a lot of time together as a family. We're playing Pictionary every night. Um, doing yard work together. We have theme nights, theme dinners, where we have formal night or Hawaiian night. Um, Brooke's been doing artwork for the neighbors so that they could all hang those rainbows in the window to show support. Um, also, she's been making cards and posters to send to the local doctors and nurses. Um, you know, it's important that you realize that, you know, you're not alone and, and you kind of, your counselors are thinking about you. And we're all in this together. We, we are, are Beth Page. Page. Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Gagliardi. Just wanted to come and talk to you a little bit about scheduling your day and how important that is. Without having a definitive time that we have to get up in the morning or a time that we have to go to bed at night, we can find ourselves kind of not having a schedule which can lead to feeling a little bit more chaotic. So set aside a time during the day that you're gonna do some schoolwork, set aside some time to maybe get outside. I'm sitting outside right now, the sun is going down, it's beautiful. Um, and then set aside some time to get on FaceTime or Zoom or Google Hangouts or whatever with your friends to catch up with them. I hope you're all doing well. And remember, we are Beth Page. Hi, Beth Page High School. This is Mrs. Vera. I'm sending you this message with just some tips on how to help maintain your mental and emotional health during these difficult days. Just make sure every day you can try to get outside a little bit. You can go blow some bubbles. So remember everybody, get outside for fr some fresh air whenever you can and ask for help when you need it. Kai, you need hey help? everyone, it's Dr. Z here reporting from home. We're safe and we're all staying safe, social distancing, and I know how hard it could be. I just wanted to tell you how normal it is if you're feeling anxious or any kind of other mixed feelings or negative emotions right now because this is such a hard time for the whole world. Um, but. I did want to stress how important it is to do something for your mental health care right now. We are taking it one day at a time. So there are things you can do to help yourself with stress management. Something that I love is these apps right here. Calm, Simple Habit, and Headspace are amazing free apps you can download on any device that helps you with relaxation, breathing, um, muscle relaxation, guided meditations. Please try it out and I hope it helps. We can do this. We are Beth Page. Hi everyone. I hope that everybody is doing okay during this crazy time. Um, I just wanted to quickly talk to you about how important it is to try to stay connected to each other even though all we keep hearing about is how important it is to stay socially distanced. Um, we're just so lucky to be able to have so many cool things right at our fingertips like Zoom, FaceTime, Skype, stuff like that. And during a time like this, when we feel so far apart from each other, we can really use some of those things to stay connected to the people who we love, the people who make us laugh, the people who can help us. So please, please try to keep staying connected to those people who build you up and who make you feel good during this time. Um, Good morning, everyone. Hope everyone is staying healthy. I know this is a lifestyle adjustment, but I hope everyone is social distancing, jogging, walking, skipping, lots of fun things to do, like play cards, walking your pet. 
baking. Come on over here. Decorate for the holidays. Making your holiday card. Cheese. Making fun dance videos. But most of all, stay positive because remember, we are Beth